Manure from livestock contains many important nutrients that are vital for plant growth. These nutrients make manure a valuable fertilizer that is easily available on many farms in Africa. Animal manure can be used to increase crop yields and improve soil fertility at a cheaper cost compared to synthetic fertilizer. So apart from improving yields of the crops, manure is also a source of income for many farmers because there are farmers who uh, sell manure to other farmers and they make money out of that. And also if you look at it in terms of um, how much a farmer is saving, the money that he would have used to buy fertilizers, the inorganic fertilizers. To make sure animal manure contains the maximum nutrients, it is important that it is properly handled and stored, otherwise the nutrients will be lost. In this video, we will show you how to maintain the quality and get maximum benefits of animal manure in six simple steps. Number one, keep your animals in a housing with a roof that allows easy holding and collection of manure. Animal manure contains a solid component, the dung, and liquid component, the urine. Both dung and urine contain valuable nutrients. Dung can be easily collected when livestock are confined at least some of the time and manure accumulates. However, urine can easily drain into the soil if there is no floor. House your animals in an enclosure with a roof to protect animals and manure from sun and rain. The housing should have a solid floor that allows urine and dung from the livestock to sit until collected as you can see here or to drain into a central collection point as you see here. If you cannot have an enclosure with a solid floor, use bedding materials that soak up urine and prevent its loss and hold the dung for easy collection. In all animal housings, both dung and urine should be collected as frequently as possible, ideally once a day, to preserve the nutrients and to keep the area where the livestock are kept clean and safe. This is also important for animal and human health. Remember to always protect yourself when handling manure by wearing gloves and overcoats, using long handled shovels, and thoroughly washing your hands after touching any animal excreta. Number two, properly store manure to avoid nutrient loss through exposure to elements and contamination. Once you've collected manure from the animal enclosure, Store it in a way that preserves the nutrients and prevents contamination until the manure is used. If it is dry enough, manure can be stored by stacking it in a heap and letting it sit, or it can be composted further to improve its value, as we'll explain later. Heaped manure can be compressed to reduce the loss of nutrients. Number three, cover the stored manure to protect it from sun and rainfall. You can construct a simple roof over the manure heap such as the one shown here using low cost and locally available materials. If a roof is not practical for you, another way to protect the manure is by covering it with a plastic sheet or with banana leaves like the ones shown here. Any material that prevents the manure from getting wet and protects it from the sun can be used as a covering. Iyombolea lazima tu na ifunika kwa iyo matawi andizi kwa sababu watutaki jua ipige. Jua ikipiga tule funzwa ya kwamba inaenda na nitrogen. Tena sababu ya pili ya kuifunika, vua ikikuja ipige inapereka umuhimu ambayo tunahitaji kutumia kwa kwa shamba Number 4 Store your manure on a waterproof surface to prevent nutrient leaching Number 5 Roofs and coverings can already reduce the loss of nutrients from manure during storage But manure that is stored on top of bare soil can still lose nutrients through leaching of urine and water you can avoid this by constructing a floor beneath the manure heap. 
Floors should be constructed from solid waterproof materials that eliminate contact with the soil surface and prevent nutrients from being lost. A good type of flooring is concrete, such as in the floor shown here, since concrete is very solid and will prevent any leaking of nutrients into the soil. If concrete is too expensive or not practical, you can place a plastic sheet beneath the manure heap, as is shown here. The plastic sheet should be made of sturdy materials and should be free from holes. Number 6. Composting of the manure to improve its quality and remove pathogens that cause diseases. In addition to building a roof and waterproof floor, a very good way to improve manure quality and make it safe for use is active composting. Composting is very, very important because one, it reduces the bulkness of the manure. So it is easy to handle it when applying it. And then remember this manure is coming from livestock and it could be having warm eggs inside from maybe ruminants. It could be having other disease uh, microorganisms like from chicken. And therefore when this manure is composted and compacted, there is heat that is produced and this is very, very important in killing those uh, 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 microorganisms. It also destroys weeds and reduces the need for weeding on the farm later. Composting can be done on any farm, no matter its size. There are two common methods. One, the heap method, which is suitable for areas that receive a lot of rainfall, and two, the pit method, which is good for dry areas. Number seven, use anaerobic digestion or AD for biogas production and recycling slurry as biofertilizer. Anaerobic digestion is a biological process where microorganisms are used to digest manure and other organic waste to produce combustible biogas, which can be used for cooking and nutrient-rich bioslurry, which can be used as fertilizer. Using a biogas digester has health benefits, particularly for women and children, because cooking with biogas does not produce dangerous smoke that can cause health problems for the lungs. Ile biogas ukigoroka, iye nyume umeeka mpia ni yakupika. Na ile yenye imesha pika tiari imeisha, inatoka yenyewe. Na ikitoka tu yenyewe inaitwa silari. Iyo silari inatumika kwa kila aina ya mumea. Na ukipanda nayo ni mzuri sana. Kuna siku nili, niliuza mitungi ka, karibu kumi. Nikaambia mtu nipe 25 25 kwa mtungi. Nikamuuzia. Na na yeye naye alikuwa anaenda kupanda nayo ndizi. Hiyo ndizi ilifanya vizuri mpaka sasa. Ukienda kwa kwa boma yako unaona imekaa vizuri sana. The bio slurry from the digester is a very good and nutrient rich organic fertilizer. To recap these are the six simple steps to help you maintain the quality and get maximum benefits of animal manure. Number one, keep your animals in a housing with a roof and a floor that allows easy holding and collection of manure. Number two, stack the manure into a heap and compress it. Number three, cover the stored manure to protect it from rainfall and sun. Number four, Store your manure on a waterproof surface to prevent nutrient leaching. Number five, compost your manure to improve the quality and make it safe. Number six, use an anaerobic digester to produce biogas for cooking and bioslurry as biofertilizer.